This video is on PAP versus CHAP. There are two general methods that are used by a point-to-point -point protocol for authentication, PAP and CHAP. Password authentication protocol is old and isn't really used anymore except on legacy systems. PAP has a weak authentication method because no encryption method is utilized, which means all information delivered is in clear text and it utilizes only two-step process to verify identity of a client. Challenge Handshake Authentication Protocol is the new standard for delivering credentials over the network. It uses an encrypted challenge and a three-way arrangement. First, client sends credentials to the server, and in response, the server sends an encrypted challenge to the client. Number two, the client responds to the challenge with the hash by combining the password and the challenge. Number three, the server compares its database information, and if it matches the user's authentication, the user is not authorized to communicate over the network. The challenge and response mechanism happens multiple times during the connection without the user being aware of it. PAP authentication only requests at the initial time of establishing the link, while chat can do it multiple times. They could do it at the initial and after establishing a link. This means it can do repeated mid-session authentication. I'd like to highlight that PAP only requires authentication to be only one side, either caller or the client, while CHAP requires authentication to be done from both sides. Which is the reason why CHAP is the new standard for authentication. 